Shalom, Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all honor, praises, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash. I like to give a double Shalom's and salutations to all the elders, bishops, and apostles of GMS. I like to give double salutations and a Shalom to all the hopeful elect, 140 to 144. Okay? And I would like to give a Shalom to all you brothers and sisters out there who believe in this knowledge, this truth, this understanding. Yahweh being the true name of the Heavenly Father, which means he to be or he exists, which the world ignorant called Lord or God. And Yahweh Shai being the true name of the beloved Heavenly Son, which means he the Savior or he the Deliverer. Okay? Which the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ. Okay? This is your brother Howard Shai, GMS St. Louis, back at you with another lesson, right? And I want to focus my attention on this devil right here, okay? This is a uh, entertainer, American singer, pop artist, rap rapper called Doja Cat, right? She from L.A. area, right? And her dad, uh, her dad is a Jake, right, from South Africa. I believe he's a Jake. He good with artistry and filmmaking. He got a, uh, made a, a couple of few uh, uh, films and artistry and stuff like that. He didn't make no real big splash in the, in the entertainment area. OK, but he's a Jake from uh, South Africa. He looked like a Jake. And you know, Jake got talent. So, you know, if I had to take an educated guess at it, I would say he was a Jake. They didn't really have a lot of information on her dad. But, you know, Jake got flavor. OK. He got a lot of her dad got a lot of brothers and sisters, too. You know, Jake liked to get down. So but on the on the other side. Right. Uh, her mom named Deborah Sawyer. She's a small hat. OK. She does the same thing. She uh, she's an artist. Good with painting and stuff like that. You know, uh, they didn't have a lot of information on her parents. Right. Her dad was a Jake and her mom in a small hat. So that makes this girl that makes her a Jake because you're. Your uh, your genes is through the bloodline of the daddy. OK, pursuant to numbers one and 18. OK. But. The point being is this is pure wicked. OK. This is pure wicked. This is whoredom, whoredom at its finest. Not as she's not only she's spiritually whoredom, you know, which which is the worst, but also on, on a on a, 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 a physical level, okay? She's halfway dressed, ass hanging out, okay? And she a whoredom on a spiritual level because the the purest form of um, uh, uh, the purest form of admiration is imitation, okay? Let me say that one more time. The purest form of admiration is imitation to imitate somebody okay so that's how she's uh uh doing spiritual whoredom spiritual wickedness okay she dressed like the so-called devil and this is nothing but a, a roman catholic uh 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 doctrine okay because there's no man in the middle of the earth that looked like this OK. You know, there's no man in the, in the middle of the earth look like this. OK. So uh, it's just another another Roman Catholic doctrine. OK. So like, yeah, I'm, I'm on my phone, but. This is just pure wickedness. OK. We go go straight to the scriptures. So like you. Bear with me. Right. We gonna go straight to the scriptures, right? And we're gonna go to the book of Jeremiah, okay? Salakia. 
me go back to this. Right? Salakia. We're going to go to the book of Jeremiah, right? Give you a chance to get it and give me a chance to get it, right? Let's go to Jeremiah 4 and 22, right? I'm going to get it on here anyway. Jeremiah 4 and 22, what it says. For this is the heavenly father, okay? Yahweh talking about his his people, Israel. He said, For my people is foolish. They have not known me. They are sodish, and sodish means stupid or ignorant. They are sodish children, and they have none understanding. They are wise to do evil, but to do good, they have no knowledge. Right. So, Yahweh Shem is saying, the, his people are stupid. Okay? They don't know him. They don't, they don't know the, the, the law, statutes, and commandments and having faith in Yahweh Shem Yahweh Okay? They don't know nothing about that. For they are sottish, they are stupid children, and they have no understanding. The understanding of turning from your wicked ways, okay? Coming unto the law, statutes, and commandments of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Okay? Worshipping and serving Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Okay? Yahweh Shai being our mediator to the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, okay? And turning from your understanding is turning from your, your ways, okay? Your wicked ways, okay? They they are wise to do evil, right? And this right here is uh, wise to do evil, okay? Okay? This is, this is a prime example of being wise to do evil, okay? They are wise to do evil, but to do good, they have no knowledge. Okay? Let's get some more scriptures. Right? I'm going to go to the book of Proverbs, right? Proverbs 24 <clears throat> and 12. Salakia. Proverbs 24 and 12, it says, If thou sayest, Behold, we knew it not. Does not he that pondereth the heart consider it? And he that keepeth the soul. Salakia. And he that keepeth thy soul. Does not he know it? And shall he not render to every man according to his works? Come on, man. You got to be crazy to think. That the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, and His Son, Yahweh Shai, don't know your heart, okay? Okay? And I'm talking to you Jakes out there, okay? I'm, I'm specifically talking to you Jakes. Because, you know, when, when, when the C-19 hit, okay? Esau knew... That Jake has something within him, okay, that makes him in tune with the with Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai, because when they when when they when they was pushing the jab, they was like, oh, we got to give it to the, we got to give it to to the black folks first. So if Esau know there's something to connect Jake to Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai, don't you think Jake know it? Jake know when he doing wrong. You got to know it. Okay. If thou said, behold, we knew it not. Didn't know what? Evil. Okay. Does not he that pondereth the heart consider it? He know your heart. He going to consider. Right. If you knew what was right or whether you knew if it was wrong. And he that keepeth thy soul, 
Because the scriptures plainly say all souls belong to Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai, right? He that, and he that keepeth thy soul, does not he know it? So he know, <laughs> he, the heavenly father knows, okay? Even the scriptures say, uh, 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 hold on. Uh, that's in the book of Hebrews. Wait a minute. Hold on. Salakia, bear with me. It's the scripture that says, sharpen and two edged sword KJV, right? So, yeah. Um, Salakia. Right, so, so like you bear with me. We're going to come back to this. We're going to go to Hebrews, right? Hebrews 4 and verse 12, right? It says, For the word of Yahweh Shem Yahushai is quick and powerful and sharper than any two-edged sword, piercing even to the dividing asunder of soul and spirit. Okay. So this this scriptures can penetrate your soul and spirit. And of the joints and marrow. And is a discerner. Of thoughts and intents of the heart. So Jake you caught right there. You caught right there. For the word of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai, okay, is quick and powerful and sharper than any two-edged sword, piercing even to the dividing asunder of soul and spirit. Okay? And of the joints and marrow, and is a discerner of thoughts and intents of the heart. So you could be you a judge even before you 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 uh 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 before even before judgment Yahweh Shem Yahweh already know he already know the deal, okay. And is a discerner of thoughts and intents of the heart, right? So Yahweh Shem Yahweh already know if this girl so called Doja Cat. He know that she know whether he know whether she knows she doing right or wrong. OK. OK. Let's go to next. Let's go to. Oh, we're going to stay in the book of Hebrews. Right. My next scripture. Hebrews. Right. Hebrews 10. And 16. Right. I'm sorry, Hebrews 10, I'm sorry, Hebrews 10 and 26, right here, right? It says, Hebrews 10 and 26, for if we sin willfully after that, we have received the knowledge of the truth, okay? She know that the devil is evil, okay? She, she, she already know that. I'm not bad for, but and I, I'm not bad for. OK. For if we sin willfully after that, we have received the knowledge of the truth. There remaineth no more sacrifices for sin. OK. And that's so heavy because. You know, Yahweh Shai came, right. That we could have forgiveness for sins. We didn't. We didn't sacrifice. We didn't have animal uh, sacrifices no more. That's why Yahweh Shai came to make the ultimate sacrifice for us. Okay. Yahweh Shai came to make the ultimate sacrifice for us so that we could be forgiven of our sins. And after that, the scriptures say we got to present ourselves as a living sacrifice. Okay. So it's, 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 it's up to us to turn from our sins. But if we c continue to 
commit iniquity, there's no more sacrifice of sin. So you got to wear that. You got to keep that. OK. Iniquity is sin on top of sin on top of sin. OK. So if you committed iniquity, the same sin over and over and over again, and you know it's wrong, there's no more sacrifice of sin. So you you got you got you got to be judged for that. If you don't repent and tr only true repentance come by acknowledging that what you're doing wrong. And you turn. OK, you turn. You revert. Or you convert. OK. OK, you got to revert or convert. To revert means to go back to uh, 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 the right way. OK, is is basically a 180. OK, just like when you say the word invert. That means you turn upside down. OK. Or you convert Kai meaning with and vert. It, it means in a verb sense, it means to change. OK. It's a it's originally a Latin word, but I forgot the, the name of it. But you can look up the word. You have to change. True, true repentance is an action thing. You have to change something. To get true repentance, to give true repentance, you have to change. OK, so with that, I hope you brothers and sisters have been edified. This is your brother Howard Shy. GMS St. Louis, and to the next one, Shalom, Shalom.